guys. Okay. So, how, what will be your answer for Abdir King? Eh? Uh, Anand Marga, I think your audio. Yeah. Sorry, Nala Eric Kane. Okay. So, so that today, second lesson, I can continue. Huh. Has she finished second lesson? But you can go through the same lesson again because Svetlana and others, uh, they didn't join. In yeah, the no. I'll just do a recap of the first lesson and then continue with the second one. Yeah. Okay. So, how would you say I know Tamil? Any one of you? Okay, I'm learning Tamil. Nan Tamil Katitu Irkan. Katitu Irkan. Okay. I know to talk some Tamil. Anaku Kanjam Tamil Pesatarium. Am I saying this right? Nan Itha Saria Salarena. So, do you know the meaning for each word? Uh, no. Okay. So, <laughs> if I'm going to ask you. Nan is I. Okay. Uh, Saria is right. Yes. Uh, Serena uh, saying. Uh, say sol. is sol. Sol, uh, say. Rena is like ing, right? Sol Rena is a doubtful question I'm asking. Am I saying this right? A ah. question format of say. Doubt. Uh -huh. Okay. It uh, I don't know. Wait, wait. Ida is this. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. If I'm to ask, if am I saying that correctly? If in case I need to ask you that. This and that. This is Idai and that is Adai. I think Sudha, we need to check it, Sudha. Uh, check, check what? What do you want to This say? Adai Nan Sariya Solrena, uh, right? Uh, and the Adata the Patena, how do you say this ka Adai Potruko? This is Idai or Adai, just check it out. Okay. Adamata Namakonjo, check Panikla. Okay, va. So, how do you say this in Tamil? Ida. Hmm? Say this in Tamil. Ida. Adai. Tamilla epadi solvinga. Okay. So, solvinga is you're asking a second person. You're asking another person. You're asking someone else. If you want to say, how will I say this? Then you will ask, either Tamil Epri Solve when you ask for yourself. Okay. What does it mean? Raju, are you there? Raju is not there, Sudha. Uh, he's there, but he's not uh, responding. So you can continue, Shubha. Okay, then I think I need to continue. Yeah. Okay. So what does it mean? How do we say that? Uh, okay. So again, each word meaning? Um, Anna is it. Enna is what? Ah, what? Ah, yeah. What? Um, uh, artam, I guess it's mean? Yes, meaning. Mm. Uh, 
idukku it it we refer to the phrase here idukku refers to the phrase any phrase which you want to know the meaning for you can say that you can say that word and ask idukku enna artham what is the meaning of this phrase okay instead of idukku i say any phrase yeah you can say any phrase and even then you will use this idukku in the phrase ku enna artham for this phrase what's the meaning so idukku enna artham in the phrase ku enna artham okay please say it again uh, idukku ana atham no oh, okay please say it again can you translate that to tamil no. so i i hope the next one okay uh, 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 you are not able to switch on or thirumba ah it's one of the two you can use either of it marubadi or thirumba ah thirumba ah solunga ah uh, solunga so the meaning again for each word um நீங்க இஸ் யூ ஃபார்மலி யூ அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் தேர் ஆர் டூ வேஸ் ஆஃப் ரெஃபரிங் டு அ பர்சன் ஃபார்மலி அண்ட் இன்ஃபார்மலி திஸ் நீங்க இஸ் யூ ஃபார்மலி அண்ட் இஃப் ஐ நீட் டு டாக் இன்ஃபார்மலி ஐ இல் ஆஸ்க் யூ நீ ஐ இல் யூஸ் நீ இஃப் ஐ டாக் இன்ஃபார்மலி maybe to a close friend of mine very close relatives or people who are younger to me ninga is used when i talk to elders or when i talk to strangers to whom i'm not much acquainted with adha is adha is uh, it or that it or that it refers to the particular word um terumba Thirumba is again. Ah, again. And Marubadi is also again. Just a repetition. You can either use either of this. You can use uh, Marubadi or Thirumba. Salunga and Sol is the root, and Lunga is the suffix when we say Ninga, right? Pardon? Um, Salunga is uh, uh, Sol. Uh, say. Sol is the verb. Yes. and lunga is suffix when we address ninga ninga right? if you want to say ni then it will be sol mm-hmm. that unga. is you tell mm-hmm. this inga part is used when you talk formally to someone when you use ninga you use this inga again in the other part also mm-hmm. and common question is did you understand how do you say that uh ungalukku purin purinjida 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 so if it is yes amma enakku purinjidu right so purunjid is understood i'm sorry i'm sorry bless you ah iya enakku puriyala so that is no i don't understand ah uh, could you please uh, say puriyala or puriyala it is puriyala 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 yeah okay mm-hmm. it's puriyala purinjidu puriyala okay mm-hmm. the question tags that we learned was what enna mm-hmm. when eppo why in which edu how eppadi why eduk 
who is yar and where is enge so i think the next session again uh, maybe we'll go back we'll just move on to the next lesson of this and that this is idu and that is adu idu adu idu adu idu adu we have to say this is a pen idu or pena 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 it's a longer version pena pena that's okay adukku na enna pannatu ipo so if i'm going to ask you what is this how do i ask you that idu enna idu enna so you know the meaning for each one what is idu uh enna is what and idu is this perfect so you have a pen with you and i ask you id enna what will you tell me um um i, I didn't understand sorry id enna id enna ah 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 id or pen 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 Pena. It's like it's it's like it has an a in it so it's like it's p e a so it's got like a different kind of flow to the word if that helps. Pena. Yeah, that's better. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. So if you have to say this is a book. Uh we would say idu or <laughs> I'll help you. puttagam 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 perfect you got it puttagam puttagam yeah so idu or puttagam idu or puttagam perfect idu or puttagam idu or puttagam yeah so i have a book with me ask you what is this what will you tell me idu or puttagam perfect that that is a house idu or vedu that is ad ad ah ad is ah uh, ad or vedu veed v veed 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 ad or veed ar ah ad or veed perfect ad or veed veed sorry no problem practice you'll get it so if i'm going to ask you ad enna ah ad or veed okay or uh, so a house what is a house in tamil ah veed uh what is a book in tamil atriyam puttagam 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 it's a big word don't worry so a book is a puttagam perfect a pen pena perfect pena so when a h so a tree is a maram maram tree you call it maram sudark maram 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 so that is a 
tree. How will you say? Adu oru maram. Perfect. Adi in if I'm going to ask you. Adu oru maram. Good. Next is elephant. Elephant, you say, ya nai. Ya nai. Ya nai. Ya nai. So that is an elephant. Uh, adu. Say, or Oh, I, I can't hear you. You can't see it. Ah, I, uh -huh. The sound just uh, stopped for a second. Uh, now is it okay? What? Now can you see me? They Can you hear me? Yes, yes. Now I can. Yeah. Okay. So, Adu or Yanai? Adu or Yanai? Yes. So, Adi in uh, Adu or Yanai? Yanai. It's not Ya. It's Ya. Yanai. Yes. Adu or Yanai? Yanai. <coughs> and one more word that is left out is kite a kite we say pattam 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 yeah can you repeat it Svetlana? Uh, pattam perfect so adu or pattam ar uh, adu uh, adu or pattam if you have to say this is a kite, how will you say? Idu uh, or patam. Perfect. So you know where you use either where you use other. This is idu. That adu. Perfect. Next is, is this? We ask, is this your pen? Or is this a book? So that to the noun, you will add a A sound. A. Suppose, first one is kite. What is a kite in Tamil? Patam. So I ask you, idu patama. I add that a sound. Idu patama. Idu patama. 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 So idu patama. Idu patama. Is the is that a book? Adu Adu Puttagama 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 Just an A sound. Whether is it a book, is that a pencil, whatever it is, okay? Suppose I show a tree to you and ask you, Idu or Yanaya. What is my question then? When I ask you, Idu or Yanaya, what does it mean? Uh, is this an elephant? Ah, I'm asking you whether is it an elephant? Yeah. But what is it actually? Um, idu or uh, maram. 
maram the answer will be since we have to say a no it will be illai illai ha illai illai idu oru maram perfect so illai idu oru maram illai iru pam illai idu oru maram it is illai 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 no. ah yeah you need to stress on that ill part because a lighter version will mean a leaf illai when i say illai it is a leaf but here we are trying to say illai illai ah that's it or maram ah that's it okay a small variation gives you a change in the meaning okay if i ask you idu or puthagama ah uh, is it a book yes i show you a pen and ask you idu or puthagama ah uh, illa idu or pen pena pena god pena we'll move on to the parts of the body first we'll learn the sense organs then move on can you tell me which what do you say an i in tamil check out the picture kan okay yes kadu 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 yeah nose ah ah moku good mouth ah uh, what <laughs> oh no ah uh, why good teeth sadam pal pal singular parkal plural pal par parkal yeah parkal pal is singular parkal is plural okay then hair ah uh, mm mudi head ah uh, thalai thalai hand what hand kai um chest ah uh, nenju stomach vai vayiru 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 fingers a uh, kai viral if it is the fingers in your hand it is kai viral uh, simply if you have to say fingers just say viral viral to be more specific kai viral kal viral okay kai viral leg kal foot um padam 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 okay so one more review which is kan uh, uh, i i'll tell you in tamil now kai um arm pardon arm kai you can say the whole hand rather okay uh nenju a uh, chest okay kaadu 
our ears here. Okay. okay. Parkal. Uh, teeth. Okay. Why? Mm. Mouth. Mouth. Okay. Moody. Mm. Knee. No. Mutti lapa. Moody. Uh, here. Okay. Talay. Uh, uh, head. So we'll try the question and the part. Idu yenna. Hmm. Uh, idu or uh, yanai. <laughs> Good. Yanai. Correct. Adu pena va. Uh, how do you say yes? Ama. Ama. Ama adu oru pen. But is it a pen? Ah. The next photo? <laughs> ah, I didn't see. Ah. Um, ta. Ile, ile adu oru uh, puttagam. God. Adu yenna? Um. Adu or uh, I don't remember kite. <laughs> kite is patam. Patam. Okay. Uh, uh, adu or patam. Okay. Idu vida. Idu uh, vida. Um. Idu or Amam or Illai, which is the right answer? Ah. Ah. Idu or Idu Vida, and I have an image there. Is my question correct with the image? Is the image a house? You will say Amam. If the image is not a house, you will say illai. Uh, amma. Amma. Yeah. Idu uh, oru vida. Good. Idu yenna. Um. Idu oru uh, kai. Kai or to be more specific, if you have to say fingers. <coughs> Kai Virau Good Adu Vaya uh, I don't remember Why is mouth? Uh, um, uh, adu or Vaya Okay. Adu yenna? Um, adu oru... I don't remember eyes. Uh, does it look like an eye? Don't they look like eyes? Eyes. I don't remember eyes. Eyes are kan. Kan? Kan. Uh, adu oru kan. Okay. Can I can I just go back to question six? If your answer for uh, for question six isn't a um um, um aru oru vai as opposed to via because like vai isn't by mouth and via the question part for it. Yeah, I'm asking you. It's via. Um, um, adu oru vai. Yeah, that's right. I think when you answered it before, you said it's still vaya, whereas the answer is actually vai for mouth. Just wanted to clarify. Oh, maybe I didn't hear it properly. Thanks, Ananda. That's okay. Uh, I'm confused. That's why I'm uh, uh, anywhere. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, 
ओके वेट पन्नो इध काला दे यू हैव एन इमेज ओवर दे इध काला I uh, I don't remember. <laughs> so, what is that image? What? Uh, what does that image look like? Uh, ear, but I don't remember ear. Uh, ear is kaad. Uh -huh. So, but what does this kala refer to? Kal. Apak. So what is a call? Me. Leg. Leg. Almost. Call yes. is leg. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh huh. Okay. So either calla. So what will be your answer? Illa. Idu aru call. Idu o idu kadu. हाउ डू यूज न But where do you use non? Where do you use yenak? Can um, anyone tell me? Non uh, uh, with the um, uh, verbs that mean actions, and uh, yenak with the words mean uh, feeling, uh, no want, and so on. Right? Or uh, non is something which. You say about yourself. Mm -hmm. You use yenak in a general term. You can say whenever you need something, that is, you want something, or you like something, you use yenak. Yenak chocolates, pretty cool. I like chocolates. There I use yenak. I say I know Tamil. In that case, I say Yenak Tamil Periyum. When you know something, or you don't know something, you like something, or you don't like something, both positive and negative, you'll be using Yenak. Mm -hmm. The I part is more about yourself. Mm -hmm. I am studying non. पड़ी <laughs> whenever you need to say that you like something or you want something you can use yenak something which you possess then you'll use yen either yen book this is my book you use yen wherever you need to say that you possess something So my name is. Can you tell me, Swetlana? Uh, Yen Peyar Swetlana. Peyar is grammatical. Peyar is the way we talk. At times when we talk, we don't talk grammatically. So we'll just say Yen Peyar Shuba. I'll tell you like that. I'll not tell you in pair shuba. I don't use it that way. I just tell you in pair shuba. Mm -hmm. So for mm -hmm. that, that's the difference between pair and pair. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
En Peru Svetlana. Oh. Can you just I... say that again? So, sorry, can you just say that explanation again about the difference between Peru and Peru? Peer mean more grammatical. Okay. Peer is more of a colloquial form or of a spoken form. Okay. When I talk, I don't talk very grammatically. Every time I don't keep talking grammatically. So then I say, M Peer Shuba. I just tell you that way. If in case I need to put it in writing, then I'll say, N Peer Shuba. Okay. Okay. Uh, and difference between N and Enadu is the same. Enadu is official mind. Enadu is again grammatical, more grammatical, more theoretical. N is the way we talk. And mm -hmm. we also use N for writing also. That is also there. Okay. N is also in the return form. Another is more grammatical. I should tell you that way. So, I am studying. Suppose, I am going to tell you. I am studying in, in, universe, in any university for that matter. Okay? If you have to say, I am studying in this university. Then, you will say, Nan. You will tell the university name Padikiren. Okay. And Svetlana, are you working? Yes. And the university in Tamil is a uh, university? No. no. Uh, you want to learn it? I'll tell you. It's <laughs> Palkalai Karagam. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> don't worry, even we guys over here use university. It's become a Tamil word. Don't worry. It's a universal word. You can learn it. Palkalai Karagam. But how much you remember? Even I had to think for a second before I could tell you what's for a university. Okay, got it. It was just like that. <laughs> I, I can, cannot pronounce it. Don't no. worry. If you want to give a try, I don't mind telling you break up. Pal. Pre, pre. Pal. Pre, pal. Kalai. Kalai. Karagam. Can you type it in the bottom of the screen in the, like, you know how you can type words? Can you type yeah. it on the screen for us? Sure. Uh, pre, pre pal, um, where do I chat? Yeah, it's pal. I'll just give a space in between so that you'll identify. <laughs> yes, thank pal, you. Kalai, Karagam. Karagam. Pal, pal. Kalai. Karagam. La, ra, and la. Ah, the sound with Z H A. Yes, Z H. Uh, ra and la with mixture with la. Yes, it's a mixture. Maybe a speciality of Tamil. And for newcomers, a problem of Tamil. Both ways, I can tell you. You get it pronunciation correctly, then it's really nice. Pal Kalai Karaham Karagam. Good. So that whole word, those three words actually are combined together to mean university? Yes, all the three together, it's a single word. Pal Kalai Karagam. It's a single word. But if I want to type out yeah. everything together, you will find it difficult to read it. And yeah, no, if I need to I explain understand. it, I can tell you. Pal is pala, which is many. Okay. Kala is art form. And karagam is a place where you bring everything together. 
So even the word by itself has its meaning. Perfect. <laughs> pal is again many pala. Kalai is art forms. Karagam is a place where you bring things together. Thanks. So that's pal kalai karagam. Pal kalai karagam. Yes. Pal kalai karagam. Svetlana is going to keep telling Palkalai Karagam. Palkalai Karagam. <laughs> nice. <laughs> it's good. So if you have to say, I am working in the place where you are working. Velai Seigirim. Velai. Seigirin. Velai is work. Seigirin is I'm doing it there. What are you doing? A work. So say is a verb which means do. Seigirin is doing. Present tense. Mm -hmm. Say girin. Say is say present tense doing where say is the verb do. Velai mm -hmm. is work. So can you complete it? The dash for me, non dash velai seigirin. Can you tell me that? Nan idu palkalai karaham padikirin. Okay. Here. I'm studying in this university. Nan idu palkalai karaham padikirin. Yes. I'm working uh, in this university. Nan ah, idu palkalai pal karaham uh, galai seigirin. It's ve lai, ve, a longer vowel. Ve, a consonant is long, ve lai. Vailai. Vailai or Vailai? Vailai. Vailai. Thank you. Okay. The name of my school is, or uh, the name of my office is. If it's a school going student, I can say school, office. So, in your case, yen, office in pair, you'll tell, you'll tell the place where you work. The name of the place, the name of the university in case you are working for a new university, you will tell the name. Uh, uh, I don't understand. Um, I don't understand. Uh, and Palin is a name. Yeah. In Pallin Pair, tell the name of the school, no problem, something. Just try to finish it, that's it. Um, <coughs> um, uh, name, I don't know the names. No problem, just skip it, next one. 
My father's name is. Uh, and Appa Vin Peyar Mikhail. Can you repeat it? And Appa Vin. In Appa Vin. And Appa Vin Peyar Michael. Okay. Okay. My father is a <clears throat> Yen um, Appa Yen Appa or uh, Engineer. Perfect. Okay. okay. My mom's name is uh, and Amma Vin Payar uh, Lydia. Okay. Uh, My... Vin is mine, right? Uh, no, N is mine. A Vin is uh, apostrophe S, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Payar name. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, Ananda, you wanted to ask me something? No, I just wanted to share what Svetlana just said is that the VIN or the IN at the end um, means the S. Okay, yeah. So, yeah. Okay, okay, no problem. No, you just came online for a second with the video. I wanted to know whether you had any doubts. Yeah, no, I just wanted to make sure, like, that's something that we covered in class this morning. So I just wanted to share that as well, just to oh, make okay. it easy Thank for you. context. That's all. So, my mom is my mother is a, an amma or a housewife. <laughs> okay. Uh, um, Nan. I, I, live in. I live in, in dash. Uh -huh. in. You can say the city mm -hmm. or the town or whatsoever. Mm -hmm. uh, Nam Sankt Peterburg Vasikiren. Okay. Again, we have a difference between Vargiren and Vasikiren. When we say Vasikiren, it is more about the town or the a smaller area. Mm -hmm. That is Vasikiren. When we say Vargiren, we would refer to the Country or continent. Okay. The country or the continent, we would refer it as Vargiren. 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 Yes. And Vasikiren is about the town or the locality in which we stay. Nan, uh, uh, what, what is Russia in Tamil? Pardon? Uh, what is uh, Russia in Tamil? I don't get you. Um, Russia, country. Uh, how it is in Tamil? Russia. Russia, a country, yeah. How do you say uh, Russia in Tamil? Again, it's Russia. Uh, like what we were told this morning is you add LA to the end of the country or the, the town. So for Australia, it is Australia La. So when Russia Whenever you have to say in, I live in, then you'll say Australia La Vasikiren. Yeah. The La part. La, yeah, so you add that to the end of Russia, I think is the answer to, to Svetlana's oh, question. Okay. So, Nan, Russia, La, ah, Vargiren, you will say Vargiren. Mm -hmm. uh, um, uh, nan, uh, Russia, La, Vargiren. Perfect.
when it is yin? Um. I like dash very much. Which one do you like very much? Um, I like Tamil very much. <laughs> so let's put in Tamil there. Since uh, it's I like, we are using it as Yenak. Yenak Tamil Ramba Padikiran. Padikum. 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 Yenaku Tamil Ramba Padikum. Perfect. I don't like. Which one would you like to say? Not like to work. <laughs> <laughs> so to work. <laughs> what is to work in Tamil? Belai. Uh, ah. Belai. To work is velai seya. Velai. Yenak velai seya pidikad. Yenak velai seya pidikad. 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 Okay. Yenak. Velai seya pidikad. Yenak velai seya pidikad. Perfect. Okay. Yeah. So I think with this, today's group session is over. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Svetlana. Thank you, Anandamaga. See you again next week.